So today I sampled for the first time the little version of fruit and fiber. Say so little, but they've um, they've got this uh, brand called Corn Crownfield, I should say. And the picture, I have to say, is very appealing. It looks just like fruit and fiber. On any other package, for some reason, they all go for purple, uh, just regardless of um, which supermarket you're going to. Anyway, I poured it out. My first thoughts, is this fruit and fiber or is this brown flakes? There was no fiber or fruit. It was just brown flakes. Um, but then, really, all I needed to do was sh give it a little shake and it all kind of emerged to the top. And I poured it out. The banana flakes, the dried banana chips, were nice and big. I like this. They're bigger than any I've seen across the board so far. And there is enough fruit, enough nut. And the flakes themselves are slightly interesting, quite, quite brittle and um, crunchier than the usual brown flakes I'm used to. Um, but this didn't put me off too much. The taste was good. Better, I would say, definitely then. Better than Tesco's. Far more in there um, of what you want. Um, however, it let itself down in just one way. And that needs a bit of a visual representation because on the corner of one of the dried apple chips, there's a sort of blue mark. Uh, blue, why? Um, it looked quite artificial. Um, I didn't eat it. It might probably wouldn't have killed me, but it did make me think, what is this? What am I eating? You don't want to be th thinking of that first thing in the morning. You want to be relaxing. So that is that is the only downside to what is otherwise a very good fruit and fibre. Three and a half stars.